The name of five judges have been cleared by the Centre of the Supreme Court. For officials said on Saturday, amid a protracted tussle between the executive and the judiciary over the process of appointments. Facing tough questions from the top court, the Centre has promised a day ago that the pending recommendations of the panel of judges, known as the Collegium for the Elevation of Five High Court Justices, will be announced by Sunday. A bench of justices SK Call and AS Oka had expressed displeasure over the delay in clearing recommendations for the transfer of High Court judges, calling it a very serious issue and warned that any delay in this matter may result in both administrative and judicial actions, which might not be palatable. Asked about the status of the Supreme Court Collegium's recommendations for the top court during a hearing on two petitions, Attorney General R. Venkata Ramani said the warrant of the appointments of five judges is expected to be issued shortly. A special court on Saturday granted bail to Congress Rajya Sabha member Digvijay Singh in a defamation case filed by BJP leader whom he had accused of being involved in the Vyapam scam that rocked Madhya Pradesh in 2013. The court dealing with the case against MPs and MLAs granted relief to the Congress leader in the defamation case filed in 2014 said Mr. Singh's lawyer, Ajay Gupta. Mr. Singh has been asked to appear in the court. The Vyapam scam relates to alleged manipulation in the selection process for government colleges and jobs conducted by the Madhya Pradesh Vyavasayik Pariksha Mandal, a professional exam board. The BJP on Saturday organized a huge protest outside the Aam Aadmi Party's office in Delhi demanding Chief Minister Arvind Kejriwal's resignation over allegations of corruption linked to the now scrapped liquor sales policy. BJP workers were seen clashing with the police and trying to breach the barricades put up to control the crowd. Others stood with the placards and shouted slogans. The BJP has targeted the Chief Minister over the recently filed second charge sheet by the Enforcement Directorate and said it proved that he was involved in the corruption. A court on Thursday accepted the supplementary charge sheet against the five individuals and seven companies in connection with alleged irregularities in the Delhi excise policy. The Capital Markets Regulator, Securities and Exchange Board of India said it has observed unusual price movement in stocks of a business conglomerate. In the past weeks, amid the Adani stocks route, SEBI is committed to ensuring market integrity and to ensuring that the markets continue to have appropriate structural strength to function in an uninterrupted, transparent and efficient manner and has been the case so far, SEBI said in a statement today. A Delhi court has discharged Jawaharlal Nehru University student Sharji Imam and student activist Asif Iqbal Tanha in the December 2019 Jamia violence case. However, the Imam will continue to remain in jail for now as he is facing probe under the Stringent Unlawful Activities Prevention Act in the conspiracy case related to February 2020 Northeast Delhi riots. The order was pronounced by the circuit court bench of additional sessions Judge Arul Verma. Now be the first to know about the latest updates on our new news app. Go on your Android or iOS, search for HW News Network. Download our app, choose the language you prefer to get updates in and be up to date with the latest news.